Are you blind like me? Can't look cute when you have these on? Don't worry about it. I'm going to show you how to still look fly even if you're blind. Let's get into it. So I'm priming my face with my Cover FX SPF 30. This is perfect to protect your skin and for my girls with hyperpigmentation. With my MAC Pro Concealer Palette, I'm going to cover up these dark spots. Believe it or not, because of Cover FX, my blemishes have been disappearing. Now taking my Makeup Forever Full Coverage in shade 18, just to kind of get rid of the blemishes that the Makeup Pro Concealer did not get rid of. Now I'm taking my Lancome foundation. As you can see, my beginning routine has not really changed. This is more so how I'm going to revolve my makeup around my glasses. And also you saw that the, bri the brows were done because I feel like the brows is such a long part of the video that you guys can kind of just see that in my other video. I'm taking now my NC45 liquid concealer and I'm placing that under my eye with my beauty blender. Because you are wearing glasses, you want to be able to have a concealer. With my Bobbi Brown stick, I'm going to, of course, add definition to my face. And I'm using this with my Cover FX foundation brush. Now taking my blotting powder in shade medium from my Cover FX collection with my Micro Beauty Blender to close up those pores from my concealer. Can't you see a difference when you add a pore finisher to your makeup? I'm, it's beautiful. Now I'm taking my NYX Curve Eyeliner and I find that it makes it easier, at least for me, to do my eyeliner with one hand when I'm doing these videos. But I always tend to still screw it up. I don't know. I guess, believe it or not guys, I am still a beginner at makeup. Now I'm just going to take my Telescope Mascara. I'm just adding any old mascara. I'm not adding lashes to this look. Now I'm taking my Matte Setting Powder from Cover FX in shade Deep to finish off this look. Now I'm taking a red lip pencil from NYX and I don't remember the name so please don't kill me. I'll be sure to add it in the description box. And now I'm using my Lime Crime Velvet Lip Stain. Oh my god. You saw my black lip stain and now this is my velvet lip stain. I'm taking now my NYX Glowing Powder and I'm just going to put this on my cheekbone because you always need to glow. So as you notice, I did cut my hair and this is a wig from Sassy Secret. I will be sure to add their information in my description box. I just became a wig lover because of them. This hair is so easy to maintain. I am definitely hooked, but I'll probably go long again this weekend. And I find that short hair makes you feel so much more sophisticated, especially with glasses. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and don't hide behind those glasses. You can still be fierce and wear glasses. Alright guys, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!